Good evening to all parents, faculty, staff, and supporters of our student attendees. It is with great honor and humility that I welcome and stand before you tonight to celebrate this milestone. It is the community of support from our parents, teachers, and staff, SISD, and EPCC personnel, as well as the hard work of our soon-to-be graduates, or our already summer graduates, that have made this evening possible. It gives me tremendous pleasure to welcome you to the MEX Summer Fall 2021 Stoling Ceremony. Tonight, we will be recognizing Summer and Fall 2021 EPCC graduates. Phoenix Family, an ancient philosopher once said, by three methods, we may learn wisdom. First, by reflection, which is noblest. Second, by imitation, which is easiest. And third, by experience, which is bitterest. Ancient legend paints a picture of a magical bird, radiant and shimmering, which lives for hundreds of years before dying and bursting into flames. The phoenix then rises from a cloud of ash, born anew to begin life once more. I can think of no symbol more powerful to represent the challenges, adversity, and bittersweet experiences you have overcome these past four years, especially this year, facing them head on each time, rising from the ashes triumphant and ready to face your next obstacle. These have been years of sacrifice, long hours of hard work, disappointments, successes, learning, and growth for all of you. It is these deepest pains and disappointments that have caused you to grow into your highest selves. I stand here today as your principal to say not only have you survived, but you have risen like a phoenix to burn through these challenges. You are a group of extraordinary and exceptional individuals who have risen time and time again and now find yourselves ready to be reborn and move on to the next phase of your lives. I encourage you to go out into the world and in every deed you do, decision you make, and opportunity you find, act as if it is impossible to fail. Now I would like to acknowledge some of our special guests. Please stand to be acknowledged. With us this evening are Dr. Marta Carmona, SISD Interim Superintendent, Mr. Enrique Herrera, SISD Associate Superintendent of High Schools. And also with us this evening are Mr. is Mr. Paul Guerra, SISD Board Trustee. <laughs> Dr. Carmona will now offer some words for our 2021 EPCC graduates. Need my eyes. Not that tall. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Mission Early College High School students, faculty and staff here present, parents and special guests. It is an honor to be celebrating with you together and in person. Buenas noches. A todos los estudiantes de la preparatoria Mission Early College, sus profesores y el personal de Mission Early, padres de familia y demás invitados. Es un honor para mí poder celebrar con ustedes esta noche juntos y en persona. I'd like to recognize our Mission Early College High School principal, Mr. Ben Ortega, and the wonderful faculty and staff for their excellent work to ensure that our students excel and achieve their highest potential. In addition, thank you to our SISD Board of Trustees for their support to ensure that we are providing the best education and experiences for our students. Of course, a giant thank you to the parents and families of our Mission Early College students because you have been and continue to be a very important part of our students' success. 
you have shown our students, your children, love and support, encouragement, and have helped us so that they can achieve their goals and their dreams. Por supuesto, agradezco a los padres y la familia de nuestros alumnos de Mission Early College porque ustedes han sido una parte muy importante del éxito de ellos. Gracias por el amor, el apoyo, la motivación y ayuda que les han brindado a sus hijos para que puedan lograr sus metas y sus sueños. We are extremely proud of our outstanding students for earning this remarkable achievement, which is a tremendous start to their future success in higher education, jobs, careers, and in life. Estamos extremadamente orgullosos de nuestros destacados estudiantes de, de Mission Early por obtener este notable logro, que es un gran comienzo para su éxito, su futuro en la educación superior, sus trabajos, carreras y principalmente en sus vidas. We have helped hundreds of SISD students earn this distinction since we introduced our early college high school programs in our district. With Mission Early College leading the way, go Phoenix, we have seen resounding success. Hemos ayudado a cientos de estudiantes de, de nuestro distrito a obtener esta distinción desde que presentamos nuestros programas de educación preparatoria y universitaria temprana. Con Mission Early College forjando el camino, hemos visto tremendo éxito. To earn an associate degree while still in high school is an accomplishment that truly amazes me. It shows so much dedication, drive, motivation, and determination among our students at Mission Early College. And it is proof of their willingness to work hard no matter what, to achieve their goals and set themselves up for a lucrative future. El obtener un título de asociado mientras aún están en la preparatoria es un logro que realmente me sorprende. Muestra la ded dedicación, el impulso, la motivación y determinación en nuestros estudiantes y es una prueba de su voluntad, su trabajo, sin importar los obstáculos que enfrenten y así poder lograr sus metas y prepararse para un próspero futuro. Students, you truly deserve all the praise and celebration today because you have achieved an incredible feat that does not come easy. Please know that this is just the beginning of what you want to achieve in life, and you are on that great path. I'm sure that you have great aspirations, and I am certain that you will continue on this great course that you started at Mission Early College and in Team SISD. You will certainly achieve what you have started working so hard for. Por favor, sepan que es esto es solo el comienzo de lo que podrán lograr en la vida y están en un gran camino para lograrlo. Estoy segura de que tienen grandes aspiraciones y estoy segura de que si continúan en este curso han, que han comenzado en Mission Early College y en Team SISD, sin duda lograrán lo que se propongan. Ustedes realmente merecen todos los elogios y la celebración de hoy porque han logrado una hazaña increíble que no es fácil. Estoy muy orgullosa de todos ustedes. Todos nosotros en el equipo de SISD estamos orgullosos de ustedes y los felicitamos por liderar con su corazón para traerlos aquí hoy. Estoy también muy emocionada de verlos subir al escenario para recibir sus escolas. Mantengan la cabeza en alto y siéntanse orgullosos de sus logros. Yo no puedo esperar a verlos de nuevo cuando se gradúen de la escuela preparatoria Mission Early College. I am extremely proud of you students. All of us here in Team SISD are. 
I congratulate you for leading with your heart to get here today. I am so excited to see you go on stage to receive your souls this evening. Hold your heads up high and be proud of your achievements. They weren't easy. And I cannot wait to see you again at your high school graduation. Congratulations again. Thank you. Gracias y felicitaciones a los estudiantes. Thank you, Dr. Carmona. And thank you for being here with us this evening and for your encouraging words for our graduates. It makes all the difference that you lead our district with heart. We would also like to recognize the following MEX faculty and staff. Please stand to be acknowledged. Drew Dungan, Student Activities Director. Silvia Bracamontes, CIS Coordinator. Ms. Elizabeth Vandervoort, MEX Faculty. And Ms. Angelica Zubia, Assistant Principal. At this time, three of our Phoenix family EPCC graduates will address our community. Please help me first welcome Jessica Irigoyen. <laughs> Jessica has been involved with countless projects in student council promoting energy efficiency, safe driving, and mental well being of our student population. Jessica, come on up. I'd like to begin my speech by thanking my family, friends, and boyfriend for encouraging me to make it this far in my education. I'd like to thank Emily and my dad for showing me love, compassion, and acceptance all of these years. Thank you, Laura Rizzo, for showing me the importance of education and encouraging me to always do my best, as well as face any challenge that comes my way. I would like to thank my mom for being my best friend, for showing me it's okay to have weird humor because I know you'll be right there laughing with me. And lastly, quiero agradecer a mi abuela María Delgado por cuidarme y amarme desde el día que nací. Sin ti, no hubiera estado aquí hablando frente de todos diciéndoles cuánto te amo, mamá. Gracias por la paciencia y amor que me has dado. And with that said, good evening, Phoenix family. We are gathered here today to celebrate our accomplishments. This day seems so far away. When we were five, we asked what the year 2022 meant. As early as our childhood teachers encouraged us to think of the future, they told us it would be the year we would graduate. Little did we know we would have a step ahead and be gathered in this room in 2021. Never did we think as kids that we would accomplish so much in so little time. To be fair, all I could think about at five was the newest Barbie. In 2018, when we first entered this school, completely clueless at what lies ahead, we learned from our mistakes, made new friends, wrote countless essays, did hundreds of assignments that I will no longer be able to tell you what they were about. We have watched each other go from scared freshmen to working, driving, and responsible young adults. As 2020 approached, we dealt with many losses. We lost the ability to come to campus and see our fellow classmates, but that did not stop us from continuing to learn and getting through this rough patch with both our MEX courses and our EPCC courses. We adapted to our professors and teachers who were also quickly adapting to their lessons. We were held at a high standard of personal initiative. We had to stay on top of our work with little oversight. We persevered. Congratulations to my fellow Phoenix. Give yourselves a round of applause because you, feel you deserve to feel proud at this very moment. <laughs> and with that said, even through the hardships, through the late nights, through the mistakes, we have continued to work hard. United we started and united we have stayed. Here's to many more years. I have to see all of us accomplish our dreams. Thank you.
Thank you, Jessica. Next, Mila Granados, who has been working with our Phoenix Yearbook, Homecoming Preparations, and in our V Girls Club. Good evening, family, friends, and fellow graduates. First and foremost, I'd like to thank each and every one of you for taking the time to be here. Individually and together, we gained the right to say that we earned an Associate of Arts degree from El Paso Community, Community College while still in high school. To our teachers, thank you. Thank you for your patience, guidance, and understanding. We will never take for granted the extra credit assignments that you accepted from us the late assignments that you worked on with us and showed us grace and understanding in helping us complete, and the advice that you gave us for our future classes. It is because of you, each of our teachers that we are here today. To our families, the endless support and unconditional love you have given us through this roller coaster of a journey has not only set us on the right path, but has also strengthened, strengthened us to be able to finish. Thank you for pushing us to be the best that we could be each and every day. To God, thank you for bringing me out of the toughest times, for holding my hand not only through high school and college, but also throughout my whole life. I can confidently and proudly say that you, Lord, are the reason for my success. And last but not least, to my fellow graduates. Throughout these few years, we have put our metaphorical blood, sweat, and sometimes actual tears towards our degree. I think it's safe to say that working to be where we are today wasn't always the easy road. From our many sleepless nights to our countless stressful days, dreaming of the day we'd finally be graduating. Here we are. We've made it to the bright side, together. Congratulations, El Paso Community College, Class of 2021. Finally, please help me welcome our Mission Early College High School student body president, representing MEX through District 9 student councils as parliamentarian, student representative, and a BPAA officer, Andrea Nunez. Good evening, everyone. For all of you who do not know me, my name is Andrea Nunez, and it is an honor to be here speaking at today's ceremony. Today is not just a celebration of completing the requirements of our diploma, but it is also recognizing the hard work and dedication we experienced along the way. A journey that at first seemed that it would take forever and would be impossible. A journey that might have made many cry from exhaustion at times especially with the workload and projects we receive while completing our associates. We would all often joke about dropping out or just failing the class, but we, al we always pull through during the hard times because we are the phoenix who rise. We even managed to continue our education even while the world was falling apart. Not only that, but we managed to do both college and high school at the same time which is not an easy thing to do. Many even had to balance that with the struggles of our cross work, coursework along with home and work life. I witnessed my classmates dealing with their personal problems, working till midnight, dealing with family losses, distress, sickness, and those happy moments. Even those hard times, we are Phoenix who rise. You, my friends, my classmates, my Phoenix family, became the best people who helped me believe in myself and continue to push forward. My classmates earning their souls here tonight are the most talented people I know and will continue to do beautiful things in the world. We will make a difference. So no matter where you go or how low you are in life, please believe in yourself because I will always believe in you. We are always Phoenix who rise. Before I end my speech, I would like to thank the faculty, the staff, and the families that help us 
and our journey towards obtaining our associates. You are an important part of our Phoenix family. You rise through struggles as well and help us to rise. Thank you. Now, please welcome our wonderful assistant principal, Angelica Zubia. <laughs> Thank you, graduates, for those thoughtful words. The main distinction in the stole is the color. A color can signify the university that was attended, a graduate's major, or an organization a student was involved in on campus. A stole can also signify an honor, achievement, or an award. The teal stole that you will be honored with this evening indicates that you are a Mission Early College High School graduate also graduating from El Paso Community College. With this stole, you represent all of your Phoenix family of years past, present, and future. Know that the classes that have come before you and the classes that will look up to you in the future are and will be proud of your accomplishment tonight. This Phoenix family is with you here tonight in spirit, celebrating the success of your many years of hard work Will the first row of graduates please line up? And as I call your name, please walk to the front to be honored with your stole. Valentina Basave. Elisa Calderon. Madison Christensen. Valeria Corchado. Alexa Farpon. Jose Flores. Gabriela Folden. Karen Garcia. Milet Granados. Vivian Grisanti. Gloria Hernandez. Itza Hernandez. Jessica Irigoyen. Renee Martinez. Valeria Martinez. Julian Medina. Michelle Mena. Brianna Molina. Kate Mora. Michelle Murillo. Michelle Muro Chacon. Nicole Muro Chacon. Alexis Nieves. Andrea Nunez.
Kennedy Ochoa. Natalia Ontiveros. Isabel Palacios. Michelle Pando. Leilani Porras. Marlene Ramirez. Brittany Rodriguez. Ethan Rodriguez. Kimberly Rodriguez. Amaris Ruiz. Deslin Ruiz. Damian Sanchez. Lucia Soto. Hannah Tavares. Emily Torres. Gabriela Trevino. Gianna Triplett. Nailea Velasco. Thank you, Ms. Zubia. Thank you, Mr. Dungan. And congratulations once again to all our graduates. Let's give them one more round of applause. They've earned it. Before we conclude, I'd like to finish by explaining the history and meaning behind tonight's ceremony. When MEX began 16 years ago, no one was sure if this experiment would work. If high school students could simultaneously complete their associate's degree and their high school diploma, MEX leadership, teachers, parents, and students at the time were optimistic and hopeful, but uncertain of the outcome. When the first 23 students met the credit requirements to receive their associate's degrees, the MEX community was overwhelmed with pride. Working together, the MEX parents, leadership, faculty, staff, and students rose to the occasion and demonstrated that hope and hard work could overcome any uncertainty. In doing so, they established the blueprint for other early colleges in El Paso and beyond. Mission Early College High School became the first and best. It was then decided that in addition to the traditional EPCC commencement ceremony, a more intimate ceremony should be held to honor the graduates' accomplishments. This ceremony was created and evolved to serve a distinct purpose, to provide the venue where parents, family, and staff could say to the graduates, we are proud of you and all that you have worked so hard to accomplish. I am extremely blessed to be part of this tradition. Graduates of the El Paso Community College Class of 2021, as the principal of Mission Early College High School, I am proud to say that you have earned the full respect and admiration of everybody in this room and beyond here today. We look forward to your future accomplishments and thank you for the legacy you leave for each and every one of the members of our Phoenix family. 
As Phoenix, you will now rise, ready to continue blazing a fiery trail of accomplishments for others to look upon and be inspired by. Congratulations, class of 2021. This concludes our early graduation stoling ceremony. Thank you. Thank you again to Dr. Carmona, Mr. Guerra, uh, Mr. Herrera, and our faculty and staff. We have refreshments out front, and I'm sure pictures are wanted. So well, uh, feel free to take pictures. Are we going to get a group picture first? Yes, yeah. Yeah, awesome. And then one right here too. And then one on the third row. Oh, okay.